In this video, we will show you how to unbox your new Airwolf 3D HD Direct Drive 3D printer and run your first print. You will need a pair of scissors, a razor blade, and some cutters. First, remove the tape by cutting with a scissor or razor blade, then open the box. Remove the top foam followed by the accessory box. Place both hands on each side of the printer on the handles in the acrylic frame. Set your printer on the table, locate the zip ties holding the belts, and cut the ties off with your cutters. Remove the belt locks. While holding the extruder assembly, cut the orange zip ties to release the assembly. Set the extruder assembly on the gantry. Take the three screws and the four millimeter Allen wrench from the accessory box. Attach the extruder assembly to the gantry using these screws. Connect the guide tube to the end of the extruder and to the other end of the back panel. Plug your printer in and turn it on. Using the LCD screen, navigate to the Auto Home command. The bed assembly will move up and you'll be able to remove the bottom pieces of the foam. Finish removing the foam by taking the side foam off. Using the LCD, navigate to the Move Access command and move the bed down about 10 to 20 millimeters. On the LCD, select the Preheat ABS feature. Get your filament ready. Cut it to a point. Mount it to the left spool holder on your printer and feed it through the back port up to the tube entry. Keep pushing it through the tube until it reaches the extruder. Apply pressure on the filament while turning the large gear clockwise until you feel it catch. Continue rotating clockwise until you see the material start to come out through the nozzle. Remove the glass from the accessory box and prepare it by applying the included Wolf Bite Bed Adhesion Solution. Cover the entire glass with a coat of Wolf Bite. Place the glass on top of the heat bed and secure it using the four clips included in the accessory box. Make sure the clips are positioned on the four corners of the bed. Place the left front clip four inches from the edge to allow enough space for the hot end to move into the home position. Remove the SD card from the SD card adapter and insert it into the slot on the LCD display. On the menu, select Change SD Card. Now select Print from SD and then click your desired file. You're all finished. Your print will begin shortly.